Uh, well, a lot of things, uh, you know, I'm very grateful that first of all I've got a character where I can uh, probably do something drastically different with, uh, with, with the look, uh, with the kind of clothes that he wears. Uh, there w won't be even a glimpse, even the slightest bit of uh, the Imran Hashmi I've seen in all the 20 films that I've done before this. Uh, it, it probably, uh, you know, it's going to be so noticeably different that uh, you might look like something drastically different. I mean, you won't recognize me in, uh, in this film. So I'm hoping it would be on, on the, far, the way he looks and also the language, being someone from a small town, learning the lingo. Uh, again, not being that drastic a departure from how we speak Hindi, uh, because it has to be in the commercial sense, it has to be understood by everyone. Uh, still, that research has to be done uh, with the language and with uh, th those nuances. And of course, uh, you know, sit with the Barker and work uh, with the character to add those little things to it. So I think the work starts now. We sh start shooting in April. So, uh, yeah. I actually wanted to work with Abhay in a totally different level. I mean, Abhay was the rebel in Oilaki, Abhay was the rebel in Devdi. Okay. So I wanted to work with Abhay in a different way because I think there is a cerebral side to Abhay. There is a brooding, negative, cold side to Abhay, which we generally don't kind of bring out. So I wanted to work on that side, and that's why, and plus the fact that a dyed in the wool, <coughs> intellectual, dry, Tamilian, Tambram, part of the ruling elite, part of the establishment. These are characters that we know. Now imagine someone like Abhay acting in that. So that's one part of it. Imran, now the first thing that I talked talk to Imran about was that there was one performance of Imran's which I had liked. I'm not going to disclose it here. For the, I mean, I don't want to diss his other performances. And I told him that, let's see, that performance I really loved. And let's try and take off from there and go about 100 kilometers further. And he said, don't tell me, that's been my favorite performance as well of my films. And we sat around and discussed that for a long time. And then I started building up from there because I think in a person like Imran, who's got a huge star command and huge fan base, there is something extremely common man about him. And there is something extremely relatable about him which till date hasn't been tapped fully. Till date, he's still the suave, slick, you know, gambler, gangster, shooting guns while flying through the air or whatever it is. And that's cool. That, that's what, you know, kind of made him what the phenomenon that he is. But there's a very relatable, earthy, down-home side of him. And that's what I wanted to tap for this film. And also, when you look at Imran, I realize that, and both of them share this, that's why. When you look at their faces, you realize that face pe kuch bol raha hai, kuch aur chal raha. There is an enigma to both of them. I think these kind of actors uh, lend to deep characterization. And Imran's character, I wanted to be a character who is common, on the road, the lowest of the low, desperate, ambitious, and at the same time vulnerable. So.